welcome to my youtube channel my name is abram adeyemi popularly known as Uncle engineer in this channel we talk about music everything about music kindly subscribe to my youtube channel and also smash the notification icon so you can get notified whenever i post good video like this in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to fix your saxophone read into mouthpiece and i will tell you i'm going to show you a lot of uh a lot of things that will happen if your saxophone read is not well placed on your mouthpiece a lot of you guys are struggling with your tone or probably you are finding your saxophone very hard to play it may not be the saxophone that is faulty it may be the way you feel the read on the saxophone that is what is actually affecting the way it sounds when you put your saxophone read on the mouthpiece if the read get inside the mouthpiece too much it will affect your tone and if the uh, mouthpiece and the tips of the the tips of the mouthpiece and the tips of the reed are not balanced your saxophone will not sound properly so in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to fit the saxophone reed into the mouthpiece and a lot of factors that will occur a lot of things that will occur if the reed is not well placed on the mouthpiece my name is abraham again popular young has sound engineer I repair musical instrument for living. Let's dive into it. So, guys, now we're about to start. Now, this is the read I'm going to be putting on the mouthpiece. Here, I have Rico M5 mouthpiece, and I also have this read. So, I'm going to fix it so you can see how the proper way in which you must fix your saxophone read onto the mouthpiece. Now, let's dive into it. Let me show you. All right, now this is the mouthpiece, and also this is the read. Now, this is the way it's supposed to be. The tips of the reed and the tips of the mouthpiece should be aligned together, like this edge and this edge should be totally be together. Are you getting me? The reed should not come out more than the mouthpiece, and the mouthpiece should not be more than ready. So, the, both the reed tips and the mouthpiece tips should be aligned together. That is the proper way to feed your mouthpiece to the reed. Now I'm going to show you with ligature, so how to do it together. Now, probably there are a lot of misconception and a lot of things, a lot of argument that maybe you should put your reed first before the ligature or the ligature first and you put the reed. But which, which, which uh, ever way, it doesn't matter. What really matter is that you need to be very careful when you are putting your mouthpiece on the reed when you are putting the reed and the mouthpiece together you need to be very careful that's all that matters now you can put the ligation first and also and immediately put the reed or you can put the reed first align the reed with the mouthpiece align the tips of the reed and the mouthpiece and very caref carefully put your ligation and screw the ligation to hold the reed to hold the reed properly to the mouthpiece. But the goal here is that the tips of the reed and the tips of the mouthpiece should be aligned together and you screw it. If you are putting ligation first, it doesn't matter. If the ligation is coming after the reed, it doesn't matter. But you need to be very careful while facing your reed, when facing your reed to the mouthpiece. So now, I'm going to show you if the tips if the tip of the reed, if the tip of the mouthpiece is coming out more than the reed, I hope you can see it here. I'm not sure if my camera is focusing it, but I think you can get it now. If the mouthpiece, the tips of the mouthpiece is coming outside more than the tips of the reed, your saxophone will sound very heavy and very hard to play. And if the tips of the reed comes out more than the tips of the mouthpiece, your saxophone will be making a brazy noise it will be making noise so that's why you need to be very careful the, with the tips of the mouthpiece they should be aligned together so i'm going to play something if with the mouth read in and the read out so you can see how it sounds and you can hear how it sounds so Thank <laughs> you. 
enjoyed this video if you enjoyed the video kindly subscribe to our youtube channel and also click the notification icon so you can get notified whenever we post video like this and don't forget to share it with your friends i remain your boy abraham at the